Misinformation is one of the biggest strengths they've got, man. Definitely. Definitely. Because we're like, a lot, a lot of the people this. I don't want to be disrespectful, but they're simpletons, fam. Like, they don't want to get, they don't want to get off their ass and find out themselves. Like, so for instance, if you were, say for instance, you're coughing, yeah, and you had, say for instance, an itchy scalp like this, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You could literally go on Google and start researching that yourself, yeah. But people rather go to a doctor and hear a doctor say to you, "Ah, oh, you've got an onset of cancer." What? What do you mean I've got onset of cancer, bro? I'm just coughing with itchy head. And then they'll believe that and live that lifestyle after that. Three minutes ago, yeah, three minutes, like three minutes, I think. <coughs> UK coronavirus hospital death toll increases to twenty one thousand six hundred and seventy eight. Although it's four hours ago, yeah, like, but yeah, it goes to that number after an incre after an increase of five hundred and eighty six. Mm. Mad, bro. See, Even man, though, can we fully shit, man. trust them? Can we fully trust yeah. them figures? Do you reckon? Nah. <laughs> Definitely not. You reckon they can be fully trusted? Definitely not. You know what it is, yeah? It's crazy because people act on what they hear, yeah? M more time. But mm. what happens is that you hear all this stuff, but you don't see it happening. And slowly and slowly you start not holding so much rally to what you've heard. And all that's really going to happen, fam. So I think with all these numbers, it's just, again, misinformation is one of the biggest strengths they've got, man. Definitely, definitely, because we're like, lot, a lot of the people this, I don't want to be disrespectful, but they're simpletons, fam. Like, they don't want <coughs> to get, yeah. get off their ass and find out themselves, like, so for instance, if you were, say for instance, you're coughing, yeah? And you had, say for instance, an itchy scalp like this, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You could literally go on Google and start researching that yourself, yeah? But people rather go to a doctor and hear a doctor say to you, ah, oh, you've got an onset of cancer. What? What do you mean I've got onset of cancer, bro? I'm just coughing with itchy head. And then they'll believe that and live that lifestyle after that. And here's what people need to do. They need to stop listening, yeah? Because even people like doctors, even people like um, police, even like people, all these people, they don't even know what's going on. So if you're listening to what they're saying, it's the blind leading the blind. Go yeah. and find out yourself, in it. Go and find the information. It's out there. It's yeah, easy. Yeah. I hear that fully. I hear that fully. Easy. That's yeah, but that's not right because then they're gonna go and put them numbers out, and their numbers are not right though. Exactly. And then people who haven't got it, they're gonna be told you got COVID nineteen. You gotta yeah. come in, mate. Yeah. How how shook would you be if you had an underlying health problem and you're right. told that? Stop it, bro. <laughs> Stop it. That must be <laughs> scary beyond belief, bro. That's mad. What? Yeah, that. I'd, fi I'd find that mega scary. I would anyway. I'd find that mega scary. Straight up. Straight up. Big up yeah, yourselves, man. everyone. Yo. Thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe to the channel all day, Make every sure. day. Don't forget to subscribe to my guy's channel. The link is right here. Drunk with days. My guy, Tyrone B. Dot. Don't know. Here. His link is right there now. There Big is. red button. Press there. Now hook up. Jeez. Jeez.